newbie to this group, High School Musical. Talk to us about what it was like when you got the news that you will be joining this cast. Um, I was so excited. I remember Tim Federley had me and Liamani auditioning together, and he was like, so I just wanted to let you know, I wrote these roles for you. So, like, the fact that he wrote me into it and thought of me, and we already had the relationship for me working on Better Nate Than Ever with him, like, it was just insane getting to work with Josh again and work with him again and then meet, like, my idols pretty much. What is your character like? Break it down for us. What is she giving? Is she giving drama? Spill this. <laughs> well, Alex is giving confidence. She's very headstrong. She like knows her worth. You can tell. She's like there for her best friend, and I won't spoil anything. But you'll see a little happen there. I'll leave it at that. But she's overall very confident. Excited to be auditioning with the Wildcats because she's a huge fan of them. Is your character anything like you were or are in high school? Um, kind of, yes. I think it's kind of similar to me a lot, just the confidence and the auditioning, all of those different things. Like, she's into the same things I'm into. And then, like, her style, too. I got to kind of help style her, like, jewelry and all that stuff. So, like, I loved her so much. I love it. Okay. Now, Beyonce has an album dropping this Friday, but you also have a little something dropping on Friday, Fairy Tales. Tell us everything we have to know. Are you so excited about your single drop? I am beyond excited. Fairy Tales coming out July 29th. Definitely stream it. It's just about like knowing your worth and knowing like people, if you want to get a, a relationship with me, platonic, romantic, whatever it is, you have to treat me like a queen, treat me like I deserve to be treated, or you won't get my time. You better <laughs> drop the hint. Listen, read the room, everybody. She just dropped it, okay? Who is your musical influence? Obviously, I said Beyonce is dropping this weekend. Who are some of your musical influences that you like liked or influenced your career in music? Well, lyrically, Melanie Martinez. I love her use of lyrics and metaphors and things like that. I love Kalani. I love Summer Walker. Um, Beyonce, like I said. I love Ariana Grande, Billie Eilish. Like, the list could go on. They're all so amazing. I love it. I have to ask another Beyonce question. What are you most looking forward to for the album dropping? Have you seen the track list? I haven't yet. Okay, so what are you, obviously you've heard Break My Soul. Yes, I have. Okay, are you into Break My Soul? I'm definitely into Break My Soul. I go around singing, you won't break my soul, like just randomly. What are you looking forward to for her album? Do you think it will be one of her best or are you like, what are you thinking it will be? See, listen, for me, nothing is beating Lemonade right now. All of her albums are good, but Lemonade is it for me. But I feel like she, I don't know, almost feel like she's going to come out with something different. Like Break My Soul, it was Beyonce, but it was new Beyonce. So I feel like it's going to be different. Okay. And we can't wait to have our fairy tale moment with you this weekend. Where can people pick up your single this weekend when it drops on Friday, July 29th? Well, Fairy Tales by Aria is coming out Friday on all streaming platforms. So wherever you get your music, you can find it. Yes. And make sure you check her out, obviously, on High School Musical. Congratulations, Queen. I'm so proud of you. You're doing your thing. Where is the bus? Oh, yeah. Where is the bus? You said we used to be a